not knowing that if he's going to recover, that was very scary. Nobody, um, there wasn't anybody in the medical profession who could give you a definitive on that. So I think managing the fear of how will he ever be himself? And I think the other part that was hard was the, the medical community had a, they admitted to not knowing a lot about the brain and concussion recovery. And so there was a little bit of, we don't know, um, a timeline. We don't really know exactly which, I mean, there was a yes and no on which types of exercises to do. Like some of it was pretty clear and some of it was, well, you should kind of try taking walks every day or try this or try that. And if it doesn't work, then dial it back and try something else. And, and we just felt like we want clear direction and confidence that here's the plan and it'll get better. And they admitted that, you know, we really can't do that.